everyone. <laughs> Welcome back to my channel. Pam here and I've got my baby. Demiko with me. Okay, so we are going to do the couples one, two, three tag. Now, if you've never seen this tag before, basically it's like each of us will answer the question for like us as an individual and then for the other person, I think. Wait, let me just read you the directions. Rules. <laughs> you and your significant other count to one, two, three, and answer the question at the same time. Okay? All right. Everybody got it? All right. So I guess we'll go one at a time for each other. All right, here we go. So question number one. We'll start with me. If your girlfriend could be married to a movie star, who would it be? You got to think of it. Don't say it out loud, remember? For you? If your girlfriend... That would be me. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Could be married to a movie star. Who would it be? Think about it. Like, I have to think about it. Okay. I think I know. <laughs> you think you know? No, I don't. Oh, my God. <laughs> <Cat. laughs> so, our cats are having fun. <laughs> Trying to get our attention. Oh, my God. I got to knock something down for sure. Okay, here we go. You ready? We have to say one, two, three at the same time. Okay, here we go. All right. One, one two, two, three. three. Robert Beyonce. Downey Jr. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's, I said Robert Downey Jr. That's a good one. I would be married to Beyonce. Yes, I'm a woman. No, I'm not a but, lesbian. But when I think of movie star, I don't think of Beyonce. Oh, you're totally right. I did it wrong. Well, she was kind of in some movies. But, yeah, no. No. <laughs> so I got it right, technically, because okay. you agree. All right. All right. Yep. You get that one. You get that one. All right, so if your boyfriend could be married to a movie star, who would it be? I already know the answer. Mm-hmm. You ready? We can't, we're not supposed to take too long to think okay, about it. Okay, all right. all right, you ready? Yeah. One, One, two, two three. three. Kate, Kate Beckinsale. <laughs> <laughs> this one. <laughs> Kate Beckinsale. <clears throat> Beckinsdale. No, Beckinsale. Okay, well, all right, we're talking about two um, different people. No, we're not. <laughs> <laughs> okay, question number two. If your girlfriend could be a celebrity, could be a celebrity, who would it be? This my two. Oh, ready? You ready? One, One two, two, three. three. Rihanna. Beyonce. Beyonce. <laughs> Beyonce, Rihanna. They are not the same thing. Okay. <laughs> I wouldn't think you would say. I would want to be married to Beyonce. I don't want to be married to Beyonce, but I want to be Rihanna. Because. Because she's just like Rihanna. wild and free. Yeah, she, she rebels against the system. Uh, okay, so if your boyfriend could be a celebrity, who would it be? <laughs> Do YouTube celebrities count? I know who would it be then. Alright, hang on. Alright. One, One, two, three. three. Do Mike Rashid. <laughs> oh, you think of Mike? Oh, <laughs> nope. Nope. So I was like, do YouTube celebrities count? My nah, Dwayne Johnson. You don't want to be The Rock? Yeah. The Rock. That, that's dope. Okay. He's a good guy. Here comes one of our cats. Hi, Fix. Want to like. <sighs> All right. There he goes. All right, question number three. You've gone to 7 Eleven to get milk and decide to buy your boyfriend. Or no, you will do it for me first. You've gone to 7 Eleven to get milk and you decide to buy your girlfriend a treat. What did you buy? You ready? Yep. One, One two, two, three. three. Hot Pet Cheetos. <laughs> I said Kit Kats. Both of them work. Well, we didn't say what kind of treat. If I wanted a salty treat, yeah. hot Cheetos. Well, and also, I'm thinking about what, was going, what would go with milk. So, I don't think it has to be like milk, though, related. Well, but I think that's where my mind is. Yeah. No, so I, I would feel get that. chocolate with milk, not I feel hot that. Cheetos with milk. Because then, Ooh, otherwise, hot Cheetos and milk uh, sounds uh, gross. Otherwise, I would say uh, green apple Gatorade. Oh. So. Yeah, that's my, that's my jam right there. Okay, so you've gone to 7 Eleven to get milk and decide to buy your boyfriend a treat. What did you buy? Mm, man. I like a lot of stuff. Yeah, you do. <laughs> 
Oh, I know. I know. Yeah. Yep, I know. One, two, two three. three. Gummy, gummy bears. bears. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, I'm getting you some gummies. <laughs> okay, number four. What percentage of housework would your girlfriend say that she does? Oh, this is a good question for us. What percentage of housework would you say that I say I do? Oh, okay. One, two, three. Forty percent. <laughs> I'll land you the other Okay, mm -hmm. down. And well, let me, can I explain? Yes, please. Because I'm also thinking of the house as like being the car too, but because the car's in the garage. <laughs> so that's why I feel you. I kind of put that weight in there. So otherwise I would say 50, but I was like, oh, well, I, I think that yeah, she would leave car the car work. to me. Yeah, so you I can would have say that car stuff. So I would do 60 if you include the car. Oh, but that means I already know the answer to your question. Because then we're supposed to ask, what percentage of housework would your boyfriend say that he does? Oh. One, two, three, Six. sixty. Six. <laughs> ding, 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 ding. I keep winning. <laughs> all right, all right. All right. Number five. If your girlfriend could choose one thing for you to get rid of, what would it be? Let's make it an item. So something in, something in your home, I guess. Yeah, let's, let's make it simple like that. An item in your home for you to get rid of. What do you mean, item? Mm hmm I have an idea, because we've been talking about it, sort of. Let's do it, then. Yeah. In my house right now. Yeah? Yeah. One, One two, two, three. The, the futon. futon. <laughs> thing for me to get rid of what would it be like in my home uh, I, I think I know the one thing that you complain about in my house it's not my complaint but you make it work but yeah you're like these just don't work <laughs> You ready? <laughs> I'm lost. <laughs> uh, wait. Okay. You ready? <laughs> <laughs> I actually. Uh. <laughs> you gotta pick something. You ready? Oh gosh. Okay. One, One two, two, three. three. The pots. <laughs> the pots. I was going to say the pots. You didn't say anything. What were you going to say? I was going <laughs> to. Oh, snap. Now you don't want to say it. What is it? I was going to say like empty lotion bottle. I mean, <laughs> but you did. And I was like, oh, yeah, she got it. So he did get rid of a lot of empty lotion bottles. Because I cleaned out your dresser. <laughs> yeah, so sweet. I cleaned out your dresser. Yeah. So but you don't complain about those to me. You do complain about the pots. That's the one. That's why I thought about that. About but those that. pots at your place are your landlord's. They're not yours. So I. I know, but I it's think in that, the house. I was like, yeah. So. I think the question is, is there something that you could get rid of, like in the house? That's the one thing you complain about. That you're like. I guess I do. Yeah. So we would get some new kitchenware. Tall stove. We get some new kitchenware. And that's yeah. that was my answer. Man, that doesn't that, have to be your that answer. question. That question because I'm just like I. I guess I don't realize that I, that's what I do. Yeah. Okay. Well, there you go. All right. We're halfway through. Number six. What is your boyfriend's, wait, what is your girlfriend's most repeated sentence or phrase? <laughs> oh, this is too many to choose. <laughs> Man, like, what do I say all the time? This is so like, okay, I like this. I like this. Okay. You ready? Mm -hmm. One, One, two, two 
Three. Shut Maybe. the whole thing off. <laughs> Mimi! <laughs> Is word or phrase? Yeah. That's my most repeated phrase. Sentence or phrase, yeah. That's my most repeated phrase. Mimi! I call him Mimi. I call him Mimi. That's like my kid voice of like baby. Mimi! Like, Mimi. <laughs> I'm always like, help me! <laughs> help! <sighs> help! Help! Okay, yeah, it is, BB. Okay, then what is your boyfriend's most repeated sentence or phrase? <laughs> right now? Like, right now, this moment, like, in our lives? I know what it is. Okay. I know what it is. All right, here we go. One, One two, two, three. And Give me that book! <laughs> Give me that book, <laughs> I don't. I haven't said that now for a while. Yes. <laughs> when was the last time I said that? When was the last time I said that? Oh my gosh! You know what? I'll do a story time video and let Demigo tell you his yeah, pork chop story. I'll tell my story. Because <laughs> it was uh, <laughs> that cat, right? It's like it's like a pet me to sleep. <laughs> okay. Number seven. What is your girlfriend's most used cuss word? We're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna censor ourselves and not say the actual word. Here we go. One, One two, two, three. B-I-T-C-H. B -I -T -C -H. <laughs> you think, oh, you're so right. You know what? No, he gets that right. Yep, yep. You get that one. You get that one 100%. Yep, you're totally right. Because I even say that when I'm speaking in the voices of the cats. And pets in general. Any animal walking by, yeah. <laughs> birds flying by, I'm like, yeah. Don't worry about me. Yeah, you're right. What is your boyfriend's most used cuss word? I know it. There you go. One, One two, two, three. S H I T. Oh, I see. I do say shit a lot. <laughs> I thought we said we were going to censor ourselves. What's well, in this case, <laughs> we're talking about. Okay, yeah, I, I do. I do say it, yeah. <laughs> There's no bleeping. Or I say, darn it. Shoot. <laughs> <laughs> okay, what is your girlfriend's ultimate favorite movie? Well, we both have the same one. Okay, so we have the same ultimate favorite movie. Actually, I don't know if that's true for you. I don't know if that's your ultimate favorite movie. Yeah. All right, let's see if we're going to get it right then. One, two, two three. three. The, the Avengers. Moment. See, my ultimate favorite movie is The Avengers. The first one, the first one, the first one, the first okay. one. So you don't mind, one, two. Well, no, you've already seen it. <laughs> so my favorite is The Avengers. Mine's The Mummy. And I thought that was something that we shared. The Mummy is one of my, oh, that's one of my, oh, but that's one of my all time, all -time favorites. All time all, and all time. It's one of my all time favorites and this is like okay. ultimate favorite. That's why I was like, I don't okay. think we're gonna have the same one. Okay. 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 So number nine, a meteor just hit. You've saved everything important. What would your girlfriend go back to get? So you saved everything important. I know. Do you know? Yeah. Here you go. Okay. One, One two, two, three. three. Your Hair. cell phone. Mm -hmm. That's important. I would already have that. <laughs> that is important. That is important. Okay, okay. I would already have that. I say this. But I will go back to get some hair, y'all. Like. Because I'd probably be wearing some hair, but then I'd go back and be like, you know what? I'm just probably going to need a couple extras. <laughs> I'm just going to grab a couple extras. Okay. A meteor just hit. You've saved everything important. What would your boyfriend go back to get? Ready? Mm-hmm. One, One, two, two three. three. My guitar. Guitar. <laughs> guitar. <laughs> going back. I was struggling with that question because that's important to you. Like, I feel like that would be. No, no. But if we're saying, like, important, I know it would be like, Mr. Kitty. Mr. Fitz, like, yeah. your computer, like, you know what I mean? Like, because those are, like, things like your livelihood. The other thing that I was going to say, um, well, yeah, I guess those, these are our given. Yeah. But if I, I would probably, the guitar, the cats, computer, like, things that we need to, like. Yeah. So the guitar, I guess, would be, like, a non-essential, kind of, like, a non-essential if you had to leave it behind. Because of those things, like, I feel like. It would probably be the thing that you could leave behind and would be the most easily replaceable, but like we couldn't replace like Mr. Fitz, Mr. Kitty, yeah. your computer is what you work from so right your now, hair. your phone. So what else other than your hair, just so I can know other than your hair that you, what would you get? 
Tamika is getting all saying we're at 14 minutes in this video. Oh, it's all He's like, let's let's talk about it. Let's talk about it. Yeah. What's one other important thing that I would get? Mm, probably some books. I was gonna say books. Yeah, he was like, probably some books. Like I, yeah, you, good. yeah you're not you know, a collector, I but I mean, I have a lot of books. So yeah, probably some books. Okay. All right, we and, are almost to the finish line. And you would get um, um, your favorite book. It would be the uh, the Count of Monte Cristo. Cristo. Yeah. All right, we're yeah. losing sunlight. Let's let's get you. I'm getting body. I'm getting darker as no, we go not. on. No, I totally not. am. No, wait, wait till you see the beginning of this video versus now. Yeah, I'm so see. serious. Yeah, no, you can still see me. I know that. That's not what I'm saying. Okay. But we are definitely losing sunlight. Okay. Okay. All right, number ten, last one. They say opposites attract is true. The saying, sorry, the saying opposites attract is true because me and my girlfriend are opposite at. I know the answer. Oh, okay. There you go. One, two, three. three. How Optimism. Yep. Yep. We are opposite. That is yeah. exactly it, right? Actually, that's the that I, that's the answer for me too, for you. Yeah. Like for my boyfriend. That's how we think. He yeah. is incredibly Optimism optimistic, and I am incredibly pessimistic, or as I like to think, realistic. I like to think it's realistic. Like my pessimism. But but, but the real but the way that the realistic is presented is sometimes just like it can be a little why you gotta come down on me like not that? over the top but it's like there it seems like there's no hope sometimes that's because there's not <laughs> oh, sorry mr cat would you guys like that's the end of the video would you guys like to see our cats yeah all right come here mr mr kitty Is Fitz. Oh, don't take the mouse though. All right, that's Fitz. He wants to get down. He's looking right. at the camera. <laughs> and here is Mr. Kitty. Can you see him? He is very dark. He's blending into my clothing. This is my little snuffle buddy. So that's He's Mr. Kitty. Claws. He's digging his claws into me. So that is the conclusion of the couple's one, two, three tag. What did you think, my love? I liked it. it you had it, fun? Yeah. I, I thought I, I knew the answers, but. But I got like the secondary of the primary. And then there were answers that you got that were actually like accurate that I was like, nah, that you're right, you're right. That's my answer was wrong. So, and you're dead on because I'm very obvious and very. I feel like I could be obvious. Wait, what? No, I only got a couple. I think you got a lot more than mm -hmm. me. Mm -hmm. So that's that's that. Yeah, he's a little cutie. A little he's cute. like, I'm tired. Go away. Bye. Okay. Hi. I love you. So that is the conclusion of minutes, our video, right. and I had fun. I so had fun too. That was hopefully. good. This is what people are doing? <laughs> wow, okay. I can do this. So hopefully we will do some more videos together um, mm -hmm. very soon, and we will catch you on the flip side. The We're going to see Star Wars. Side. <laughs> okay.